The door's open. Ah, the door's open. It's open. Oh. All right, you guys, welcome back to our channel. This video is actually coming out on Christmas. So, so guys, we wanna start our video off today by wishing all of you a very, very Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas, everybody, if you're watching this. Thank you for watching this on Christmas Day. If you are not watching this and you're gonna watch it another day, we're wishing you a belated Merry Christmas. You guys are amazing. Thank you for your support throughout this entire year, especially during this holiday season, as we have done some acts of service with your kind and generous donations. So guys, Merry, Merry Christmas and happy holidays to all of you. We love you guys. We're so excited because today's video is the perfect way to celebrate Christmas, the true meaning of Christmas. We've had the opportunity to do some good, to give to a family in need this Christmas with your help. We've shopped for them, we've wrapped their gifts, and tonight is the night where we get to deliver this special delivery to this amazing family. And you guys have seen the videos. You saw us on the live wrapping the gifts. You joined us in shopping for those gifts and now you're gonna join us in delivering those gifts. But first, we wanna give you a little flashback to yesterday when we were wrapping the gifts so that we can show you a little more detail. All right, you guys, we are back in the family room spread throughout the house here. I am in my Christmas jammies. I am Papa, in case anyone's wondering. This is Papa Bear, that is Mama Bear, and I have a bunch of little bears. I have four little bears actually. We're gonna kind of connect the dots for you here for a second. Yes. So we, as our final service for December, decided to adopt a family in need. A family whose mother has cancer, who is having a very difficult financial year. And Medical bills are very expensive if you're going through cancer. Very no. expensive. So we teamed up with Justin's company, Opinion. They provided some basic needs, some boots, some hats, some mittens, some underwear, some socks. And then we were able to go and shop for these kids to provide Christmas for them. If you guys have not seen that video, I'll link it above now so you can go check that out. Very, very fun time for this uh, as a family to go do that. So we went shopping. At Wally World. Then. That's a really important point because we love Walmart. <laughs> so. <laughs> Landon, are you dumb, singing? Dumb, silent night down there. Silent night. <laughs> Next we brought you along with us, showed you every present that we bought while we wrapped them on the live. So if you haven't seen the live and you wanna see the details on these presents, you gotta go back and watch that. But we'll give you a little sneak peek if you haven't seen that yet. So, little sneak peek here. We have some of the presents already wrapped, but we got something to pamper the mom. Ava over here has been going to town wrapping all by herself. We're so proud of her. Look at this wrap job. Ava May, high five, you did this all by yourself? Oh. You're gonna have to go to the live to see everything, but she has the youngest girl, the eight-year-old girl, and this is probably the highlight for her. What do we get her, Ace? <laughs> a light-up scooter with 200 LED lights. If you wanna see what else we got her, maybe go check out her live. Guys, I love, Ava just like embodies the spirit of Christmas, but she also embodies the spirit of like, she just loves to rap, she loves, she loves anything girly, and I think it's cool, it's cool. I'm a proud dad. <laughs> For Secret Santa. Uh, Sub for Santa. 11 year old. Actually. 11 year old boy, and what was the only thing he wanted? Roll the lights, so. He I wanted him so. A little bit of here, so. Tell him why. What are we waiting for? Roll blades because they haven't arrived yet. They're and supposed to come today. Let's go check the front door. Let's go check. Not here. Nothing. Oh, man. 
We were hoping. We asked everybody in our live to cross our fingers that those would come. They're supposed to come today. They'll definitely come before tomorrow, pending some shipping disaster. So we got his 11 year old boy. Also likes to color. We got him this cute little Spider-Man. We're wrapping this for the mom so she can be pampered. We wanna get her a little bit of something to help her enjoy some rest and relaxation. So we got our little foot bath. And this we did get some candy cane treats for all the kids. As Lindsay was mentioning, we wanted to give you a little bit more insight to this family that we will be delivering gifts to today. So Turin, tell us who you got real quick. I have the 18 year old. This is a Walmart gift card, Wally's World. Wally's World. This is the book Ichabod. This is the Brain Games. And this is the Chess Slash Jeffy's board. Which will be a ton of fun. This is a good rack. For all you Bobby Fishers out there, you'll appreciate that. I know you how much your family loves soccer, so I've been training hard at the North Pole. I brought you some soccer balls. You can eat only a few more days until Christmas. You guys, look at his soccer jersey. That's so funny. Ooh, those look like yummy soccer balls. They are. They're not soccer balls. They're not? Landon, did you see Jeff came? Yeah, I did. <laughs> how did you get that? How did he get in that outfit? I don't know. So funny. All right, I think we're getting close on the wrapping here. We've got the 18 year old boy, the 15 year old girl, We've got the eight year old girl. Ash, where are the rollerblades? Should we check the front door? See if they came? They were supposed to come yesterday and they got delayed. Wow. They came! Ash, and that came in just the nick of time. We're about to go deliver and it just barely got delivered. I'm pretty sure this is a Christmas miracle. The beauties themselves. This little boy is gonna be in line skating before he knows it. So what's very unique actually about today, besides the fact that it is Christmas, apparently Saturn and Jupiter are, I guess, aligning as one superstar, as they're calling it. They're actually calling it the Christmas star. Is there a better night to deliver Christmas to somebody than on a night like tonight, where you have the Christmas star, something that has not happened. I think it's happened twice for the first time in over 800 years. So what a unique experience tonight where we can see Saturn and Jupiter come together to form one big Christmas star. All right, you guys, we have arrived. We are actually quite a ways away from our home. What's amazing out here is you can see the stars so well, way better than you can see them at our house. Guys, this is a beautiful area. Oh, it smells like fresh air here. This is like the countryside out here in, in Utah. This is amazing. Okay, we're gonna get these gifts, we're gonna deliver them. Now, because she has cancer, we want to be sensitive to that situation, so we are not gonna go in the home. We are just going to put them on the doorstep, ring the doorbell, stand back, wave, wish the family Merry Christmas. For the sake of their privacy, we are not going to record that segment. It's open? Oh, good job, Lando. All right, you guys, as you know, we delivered our supper Santa tonight. And to be honest with you, going into it, we didn't know what to expect. We knew that the woman was recovering from a tough year of chemotherapy and we wanted to be sensitive and wear masks and assume to just stand a distance away, you know, as we delivered these presents tonight because we didn't want to expose her to anything, of course. And when we arrived, we started stacking the presents on the steps and we weren't even fully done putting them there and the family opened the door and asked 
asked if we were sick, we said no, and insisted that we come in and sit down and talk with their family. And So everyone put a mask on. We went in and we just, guys, they're the most humble, most well-deserving family that we have met. It was not an experience that we were expecting. We were expecting just to leave the gifts and, like Lizzie said, say hello and Merry Christmas from a distance, but getting in there and just feeling just kind of the spirit of Christmas in their home and, and learning about some of the things they've had to go through, uh, it was incredible. It was, and it was... It was really more incredible for our kids to just have them hear the stories and really engage in the conversation and it was awesome. It was beautiful. It just made the whole experience so much more real to be able to meet the family and meet each one of the kids. They kind of gave us a snapshot of what this year has been like for them. The mom has been through six months of chemotherapy, multiple surgeries, and they were kind of explaining all that that entails and it is a lot. And it really has affected the the whole family, you know, the mom obviously has not had the physical ability to do all of the things that she normally does. The medical bills have been insane. The kids are all just pitching in, you know, to try to fulfill all the household responsibilities. <clears throat> yep. What's really cool though is it's, I mean, the community has really rallied around her and her family to help support them. And, you know, this trial, with as tough as it has been, has brought a community together, it has brought families together, it has mended family relationships, she has told us. It was just incredible to hear, to hear their story. We are so grateful to be a part of it. They said that they have experienced so many miracles along the way. So many fundraisers have paid their medical bills. So many people have volunteered to drive her to chemotherapy or to bring groceries. And the biggest miracle of all is that she just barely found out that she is cancer free. She is currently in remission. Which is awesome. What a what a beautiful Christmas miracle that is. So obviously we came bearing gifts, but we received the greatest gift of all to be able to meet their amazing family and feel inspired by their story. So you guys, thank you so much for being a part of this with us. You guys are incredible. Merry, merry, merry Christmas. We love you guys. If you are new to our channel, be sure to subscribe down below. And guys, here's to a great Christmas and an even better 2021.